good day. This is Great Grandpa, Paul Eugene, and I am back with another exciting seated chair exercise workout. This workout, workout I have in my mind to make it accessible and easy for seniors, baby boomers, anyone who may be recovering from an injury and need to sit, exercise, and get fit. Also, it will benefit some of the elderly. Yes. Now, if you choose to do this seated exercise with me today, here's what I need you to remember. I need you to pace yourself. Listen to your body. If it's telling you not to pump your arms, but leave your arms here, then do that. Also, I want you to stay hydrated by drinking plenty of water during and after the day's workout. Yes. Now, are you sitting up tall? Yes. Are you in a sturdy chair or wheelchair? That'll work too. Guess what? I want everyone to give me four marches right there. Three marches. I got a change coming up. And two marches. Yes. And one more. Everybody, hold our marches right here. Now bring our arms down alongside our chair. We're going to take in some fresh new oxygen for this fresh new day. Let's inhale up. Exhale out. Again, inhale up. Yes. Exhale out. You got this. One more time. Inhale up. Excellent. And exhale out. Now, just march, march right here. Now, we got some fresh new oxygen into our bodies for this fresh new day that has been given to you and to me. Let us open up and receive this gift call today. Now, keep the march. Now, from here, I'm going to change the movement with our arms. Yes. In fact, I think I want you to do basketball with me. Keep the march. Watch me. We go. Shoot the ball. Shoot the ball. Right there. Pass the ball to me. Yes, as I'm passing it to you. We got to use our imagination. We got that ball on our hand. Release it. Yes. Throw it to me. Yes. I'm throwing it back to you. We're exchanging it. We're a team. We're teammates. Everybody. And four, three, march right here. Now, how did you do, how did you do on passing that basketball around? I just heard Mary say, Paul, um, what happened to the basketball? We stopped passing it. Well, Mary, they're right here. Yes. The balls are just sitting still. They ain't went nowhere. But guess what? I want us to use our imagination again. And let's just pick up the basketball. Now, this time, you're going to reach out to the front to me. We're passing it back and forth. While we're doing this action, we are warming up our arms. Our biceps are in the picture. Yes. Do I have any people out here who can be uh, three-point shooters? <laughs> ah, you're that good, right? Give me four more passes. Three more passes. Two more passes. And march it out right here. Good job. We put the basketballs away, OK? Listen up. Now, we're going to work our heels. Yes. We're going to cause our ankles to get some action here. Now, you keep the march, and let me demo, OK? And four, three, two, I go. Heel press with my arms coming out. Or you can say, we're still passing what? The basketball. Let's imagine we're still passing that ball. Yes, we got heel press going on. And four, three, are you sitting up tall? Two, again. Now give me four more, three more, two more. Let's just march it right here. Now, 
how did you do on those hill presses? And um, did you still pass that basketball around? I know you did. Now, listen up. We did the hill presses. <clears throat> yes. We took our arms out. We did the chair march. Now it's time to do what I call the chair side step touch. You keep the march and watch me. Or join me. Tap to the side. Right there. This is that chair side step touch. Easy going. Still stand up tall. You got it. I know. Mary told me that she still passed the basketball. Okay, Mary, you're tapping and you're passing the ball. Well, that's good. You have upper and lower body going on. And so do we. Now give me four. Right there. Excellent. Three. We're all looking good. And two. And one more set. Everybody, let's march it out right here. Now, how did we do? Now, I think that you and me, we need a fresh hug for today. Have you had your hug today? I didn't. So let's go into the hugs. We go, arms out, in, out, in. Our feet are still marching? Yes, right there. Have your hug today. You got it. Excellent. Give me four more. And four hugs, three hugs, two hugs, last one, and just hold it right here. You got your hug going on? Now we're gonna work our hips, our buttocks. We go around, four, yes, and a circle, three. Oh yes, we're massaging them, two. Oh yes, and last time, good job, now hold it. Right here. Now we're gonna go the other direction. Go around four. Yes. Three. Yes. How are you today? Two. And one more. Hold it right here. Now bring those arms out. And we'll bring those down right here. And everybody, that's what? March, 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 march. Excellent. Now, did you enjoy your hug today? I did, listen up. Now we're gonna move on. So what we're gonna do is what I call a slight jab out front. But you can march and watch me. I'm gonna go like this. Heel and jab. <laughs> a heel and jab. You see how I'm pulling my elbow back? Right there, locking it along the side of my body. Yes, again. Four, three, two, one. Again, go. Eight, seven, woo -hoo! six, and five, four, three, and two. Everybody, march, 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 march. How did you do? On that move. Did you get that? Heel press out and that jab and you pull the elbow back. Good job. Now we got to move on. So what are we going to do now? We're going to go back to that step touch but this time we're going to reach our arms up over our head stretching out our side. Ready? We go. Step out. Reach. Right there. Easy going. Get a good nice stretch in there. Get some cardio in as you move those legs. You do know that the legs are the largest muscle group of our body. Yes. So we need to what? Really exercise them. Now ladies and gents, we have eight more reaches. Follow me, eight. Seven, good job. Six, five, four, three, and two. One more set and march. 
right there. How did you do? Did you like that? Reaching over, stretching their side, and that's a good thing. But you know what just came to my mind? It's back in the um, olden days, that is, my olden days, when I can do step aerobics. Now, are your legs going up and back like mine? Yes, they are, good. Keep this moving. Now, back in those days, we should do a arm movement that went out and up. Now, you keep this movement, and I'm gonna show you, and you're gonna come with me. And four, three, two, it went. Up, out, up, out, up, out, up, and out. That's it. We're reaching high. Open up our chest. Open up our heart. I like to say, well, we're reaching up. We're reaching up to a higher place in our lives. We're not staying in the same mindset that we were before. And when our arms come out, we're open up our heart. Yes, we're open up our soul to new possibilities. Oh yeah, I love it. Ladies and gents, let's try four more sets. And four, yes, and three, excellent. And two, yes, and last set, everybody, drop your arms and march. How did you do? Now that slightly caused our heart rate to rise because when our arms go up over our heads, above our heart, the heart starts to work harder. And that's a good thing for you and me. Yes, we want that heart to work harder. Yes, so it can punch, it, so it can push more blood efficiently to the other parts of our body. Now, I hear new music. So that means for you and me, New moves. So everybody say, woo hoo hoo. Let me hear you. Woo hoo hoo. Let me hear you again. Woo hoo hoo. One more time. Woo hoo hoo. And march here. I love it so much. Now, you keep the march, and I'm going to show you our new move. It looks like this, we go. Out, clap, clap. Right there. If you haven't joined me, join me now. Arms up, legs wide, and clap, clap. Yes, again, go. Four. Excellent. Three. Excellent. And two. Excellent. And one more. March it right here. Now, how did you do on that uh, V step? Yes. Now, what we're going to do is let the V step start on this here left side first. Count down. March. Four. Yes. Three. Two. Sit up tall. Get ready, Tom. Get ready, Lucy. Get ready. Four. Three, B step left. Eight, seven, that's it. Six, five, four, three, and two. Let's try it eight more times. Count with me. Eight, seven, are you counting? Six, five, oh yeah, and four, three. And two, and march, march, right here. Excellent. Now, I'm gonna test our brain. Yes, see, as we get older, we need to continue to challenge our brain. So, here's the picture. We're gonna do four V steps going right. Then, after the fourth one, we're gonna go left for four. Are you ready? <clears throat> And two, dig in deep. B step right for four. Four. 
three, two, are you ready? Now take it left, four, good job, three, two, take it right, here we go, four, three, looking great, two, take it to the left, last four, three, and two, march it right there. How did we do? I know we did fantastic. So we got to celebrate. How does Coach Paul Eugene celebrate? Ah, Marlon knows. Ready? We go. Arms up. That's the celebration right here. Excellent. Wave those hands. Move those arms like you just don't care. Here we go. Again, count with me. Eight, seven, I can't hear you. Six, five, I hear you now. Four, three, and two. Everybody, drop your arms and march. Good job. Now, how did you do? Let me ask you this question. Now, march up and back. How would you rate your workout right now? In other words, how are you feeling? If you feel that you're working out between a one and a three, that is a light or beginner's level. But if you feel you're working out between a four and a six, that's a medium or what? I do a range. But if you believe you're working out between a seven and a 10. That's high or advanced range. If you can't work out at that level without choking, then bring it down, all right? Now let's get back to our what? Seated exercise. Chair, workout, keep the march. Yes. Now I'm gonna take it a tab higher. Yes, we're gonna do our seated jumping jacks. We go eight, four, seven, six, five, four, three, two, one. Again, push eight, seven, Six, five, four, three, and two, and one. March, march. How did you do? And how did Miss uh, Oliver do? Are you getting those steps in? Miss Oliver, can we go back to the jacks? Count down. And four, woo -hoo, three, and two, everybody, jack it up. Eight, seven, six, five, come on, four, three, and two, and one, and march, march. How did you do on your jacks? Did you get that heart rate to climb up? Now, I'm gonna challenge us. We're gonna go skiing, right in this chair. Yes, and four, three, keep the march. Two, watch me if you don't know what I'm gonna do. I go, eight, seven, six, right there. Five, four, three, two, again. Press it up, give me eight, count with me. Seven, come on, six, five, I can't hear you, four, three, and two. Let's challenge ourselves, eight more. Eight, seven, six, five, four, three, good job. Two, and march it out right here, woo! How did you do? 
How did, how did I do? I did fantastic. I'm feeling good. I'm feeling great. I'm getting stressed off. And that's great. Now, I know my friend, Miss Renee, she likes me to do chair burpees. You say chair burpees? Certainly. You keep the march? Watch me. I go here, down, here, and clap, clap. Here, down, up, clap, clap. Join me. Touch the floor. Up. Yes. Here, down, up, again. Go. Down, up, again. Down, here, up, thighs, floor, up, again. Down, up, and march, march. How did you do on those modified chair burpees? I had a blast. Now, we're gonna continue on. But I heard um, Mary Sue whisper in my ear, she wants me to do those burpees again. But she said, can I add some jacks at the end? Certainly. I like when people like to be challenged. We have to be challenged or else we won't be getting fitter. Yes, don't just set up for being just fit, but we want to continue to get fitter. And four, get ready. Dig in deep. Three, ah, dig in deep. Two, <clears throat> yes, and one. Are you ready? Here we go. Burpee, we tap thigh, floor, hair. Clap, clap, and march. One, four, three, two, and one. Thighs, floor, here. Clap, clap, jack, four, three, two, and one. Here we go. Thighs, floor, thighs, clap, clap, and jack. Excellent. Again. Thighs, floor, thighs, jack, jack, four, three, two, and march, march. How did you do? Now, I just heard, heard um, Jane, let's call her name Jane, okay? She said, well, after the four jacks, can you add those four skis? Certainly. Now, are you up for the challenge? Now, Jane is putting us on the, on the block. She put a blast out there saying, work harder. And four, three, here we go, here we go. Five, four. Five, jack for four, three, two, ski for four, four, three, two, and march, march. Here we go from the top. Let's hit it now. Thighs, floor, thighs, clap, clap, and jack for four, three, two, ski for four, four, three, two, and march, march. We got it again from the top. Hit it. Thighs. Floor, thigh, four jacks. Now ski, ski, four, three, two, and march. Keep the march right here. Now talk to great grandpa, Paul Eugene. How did you do? Did you get those, all those moves done? But for good measure, let's try it again. Here we go. Thighs, floor, thighs, clap, clap, and jack. Four, three, two, ski for four. Four, three, two, and march for four. One more time for final good measure. Right here, thighs, floor, clap, clap, jack, jack. Four, three, two, now ski, ski. Four, three, two, and march it out. There you go, we did it. How you feeling? Do you feel like you're being rejuvenated? Do you feel more energy and your soul and your heart is singing for joy? I know it is. Now, listen up. I'm gonna do one more move. <clears throat> yes, because we gotta work our legs and our core and you're coming with me. Who wants to work their core say, woohoo, yes. <laughs> so, here's the picture. 
We're gonna take our arms up right here. We're still marching right here. And all we're gonna do is pull, legs up, right, left. Go, eight, seven, six, good job. Five, four, three, two, again. Now as we raise our knees up, we're pulling our knee up and to our gut. So that's causing us to work our abs. Yes, you can feel it right in there. Give me four, three, and two. Everybody, march, march right here. Now, how was that? Talk to great grandpa, Paul Eugene. I know you got it, but guess what? Can we do it again? Ready? Let's go. Eight, seven, dig in deep. Six, and breathe. Five, sit up tall. Four, three, and two. March it out right here. You did a good job. Now bring those arms alongside your chair. Let's take in some fresh, fresh oxygen right here. Take it up. Exhale out. More oxygen. Take it in. And bring it down. Last time, fresh oxygen. And bring it down. Everybody, march here. How did you do? I'm ready to what? What? Box it out. You gonna box me out? Let's go. Eight. Come on. Seven. Six. Five. Good job. Four. Three. Two. One. Again. Last eight. Seven. Smile. Six. Five and four, three and two, and march, march here. Good job. Now I'm gonna start bringing you and me down. Yes. So we're not gonna march as hard. We're gonna change these marches to simple heel presses right here. No hands. Eight, seven. How you doing? Six. And five, last four, and three, and two, and one. Good job. Now take this leg here, extend it out. You may need to come up a little bit. And we're just stretching out that leg right here. For four, three, <clears throat> two, and one now. Bring it in. Yes. Take this leg out. And hold here for four. Three, two, and bring it in. Good job. Take the arms out behind your back. Open up the chest. Right there. For four, and three, and two, and one. Release. Bring this right arm up across the chest and hold this stretch right here. For four, and three, and two, and one. Release it down. Other arm up, across, hold. You got it. For four, and three, and two, and one. Release it out. Good job. Now inhale up. Bring the hands together and bring it down in front of our heart. Isometric stretch. Well, I'd like to thank you for joining me today for this exciting seated exercise workout. Here's what I need you to do. Grab some water, wipe your brow, and keep your exercise going. This is great grandpa, Paul Eugene. I want you to go for it today filled with great peace, great love, and great joy and your heart and your soul. I will see you next time.